Hey everyone, it's Rain, and yeah, I'm finally back. It only took about three months for me to get a new camera, but in the meantime, I did update Rain's model a little bit, so meet Rain 2.0. Uh, this is actually my first video back with him, and I figured what better video to react to than I caved and tried Genshin Impact for the first time by Jaden Animations. Uh, Jaden Animations is one of my favorite YouTubers, and the fact that she played the main game on my channel, uh... It was, it was like the perfect alignment for my return video, so yeah, that's what we're going to be watching today. Jaden, I love you. I love all your videos. I've actually done reactions to some of her videos before. If you guys want to check those out, I, I'll probably leave a link to the ones I've done. Anyway, let's get started because I'm really excited. Genshin Impact needs no introduction. It's taken it does the not. atmosphere <laughs> by storm since being published in 2020, is enjoyed by millions of players all over the globe, and even if you've never played Genshin Impact before, you've definitely heard about it. Up until this yeah. video, I was in the heard about it but didn't know anything about it category. Not for any particular reason, I kinda so, just don't do it. Fun fact, weird tangent here. I was actually, um, I started playing it in the first week, cause it was free. So I tried it, and it plummeted me into a gotcha rabbit hole. And now I play primarily gotcha games on my channel. So thank you, Genshin. Jaden, don't fall for it. <laughs> Anything ever? I don't know why. I should probably figure that out. It might be a therapy thing. As I was sitting on don't the floor, barely swipe. existing one day, Genshin if you swipe once, you'll swipe again. Suddenly reached out. Hi, Jaden. I see you're up to your usual nothingness. How about we pay you to play Genshin Impact? Okay, so yes, this <laughs> video is surprisingly sponsored by Genshin Impact. Congrats! My first sponsor on this channel. Wow, are you proud of me, parents? No, please don't. Wait, go. really? Is I'm it her first sponsor? That's Impact, actually incredible. It's going to be a good video and experience. Here, watch. I'll prove it. I'm talking to Paimon, my spirit companion that I see all over my Twitter feed, about my past. Yeah, I was literally just minding my business, traveling from world to world with my sister, when all of a sudden some <laughs> sustainer of heavenly principles goddess appeared. Richard the Absorbed Void. My sister with cubes and chained me to this land. Biggest hater I've and ever stole your seen. power. <laughs> yeah, that's that's crazy. Anyway, thanks for saving me from drowning in the ocean as we walk and talk. See, she's a, a fish. You can eat her. Are scurrying around. Of course, I was scooping up all of them. The ecosystem was definitely starting to crumble with me on this planet. Now I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Let nature. Um, while I'm here, fun fact: I for like the first like month or two of this game, I never collected like the lizards and frogs and stuff. And then there was actually a quest, a random quest in Leeway, where you had to collect, like, five or six frogs. And I just didn't have any. Like, you needed frog legs to cook something. And I'm just... I literally spent an hour trying to go all over the map to look for frogs. And I, I had no idea where they were. Inventory. No to idea. To hoard. As I'm chasing a squirrel around the lush forest, we discover a mysterious statue in the middle of a glistening pond. Oh, hello, great wind god. Maybe this isn't the time to have 12 lizards stuff. Is Venti all that great I'm suddenly though? I'm granted mystical powers by the statue. I feel like Venti... And can now see the map. The city of Mondstadt is close by, so we decided to head over there to see if anyone knows anything about my lost sister. But while walking, we ended up stumbling into a strange bard talking to a dragon. The fact That's that it's like one for one sister. almost. Unfortunately for everyone, I have a little <laughs> with the actual pickup, game which was really gets us cool. caught and both the bard and dragon scatter. Closer to Mondstadt, we run into Amber, a knight who warns us that a dragon called Storm Terror, an awesome name, has been terrorizing the town lately. <laughs> she then joins our party to lead us to safety, which is crazy because I thought you had to spend money to get girls to join your party in this game, but this one just joined us for free. In Mondstadt, Five Amber stars. then gives you us do. a wind glider. Woo! Flying! I take a running. You guys don't want to know how much I spent on Raiden. <laughs> out my new wings when suddenly the dragon shows up and I have a, a C2 Raiden and I am not town. afraid to say that I will for her. With a full view of the dragon, I do what any sane person would in that scenario. Storm Terror ends up fleeing, and as a reward for shooing him off, I'm introduced to basically the protectors of Mondstadt. I'm Jean, the acting grandmaster of the Knights of Favonius. Love Jean. Kaya. Very impressive going up Meh. against the dragon. 
Stay away from You're me. Hot. They take me to various <laughs> temples, crushing these dragon's breath crystals that apparently gave Storm Terror power. I was just happy to be smashing rocks though. Why did Storm Terror look like a freaking Digimon there? Has significance, but he's dead Maybe it was the standing now. on two As legs thing. the group thing. was talking amongst each other about important stuff like what to do next to ensure the safety of the townspeople, I wandered off and kind of started doing my own thing. Helped some people, did some cooking, fought for my life against some hyper aggressive and pissed animal hyperspaces <laughs> Rubik's Cube boss named Beth I accidentally stumbled into, which definitely didn't take me way too Especially long to if you first started. Those things Such start enough. off at like level 40. I then 40. found the bard from earlier doing a guitar solo for the town. He introduces himself as Venti and tells about how him and Storm Terror, whose real name is Devalin, used to be friendly before it was attacked and poisoned by another dragon, leaving him bitter and angry. Venti essentially says, I can fix him. <laughs> Do you want to come in a I was going to say me? something and I forgot it. Yes. <laughs> With a freshly so face. holy liar, we were able to summon <laughs> Devalin, who pulled a bit of a sundere and was like, If you really cared about me, then you'd come to my castle, but you probably won't because you hate me, don't you? You hate me and want me dead. I never I, I never thought of Devalin right. as a sundere. No, Devalin, come back! But I can see it. Riff I made. Bada bing, bada boom, we entered his lair and started fighting him in a swirling vortex. No, no, take your time. The dragon eventually falls, we purify him, and the day is saved. Yippee! Happy dragon, happy Mondstadt, happy... Wait, I was supposed to find my sister, not fight a dragon. Even though I'm riding yeah. the high of saving all these people and a dragon and being awesome. You kind of get very sidetracked. To continue my journey. The town sits on the edge of a cliff. Sparkling what? What? No! What? <laughs> wait, wait. Wait, what? I, I get it's the newest region and they... It spawns it. They probably want her to, you know, talk about the new region and the new characters. That's probably why it's coming up. But, like, we're only halfway through the video, and she did she not even mention? I don't... She didn't even mention the other regions. Holy crap. Okay, I guess we're just jumping three chapters ahead in the story. All right. It's around it, framed perfectly by the mountains behind. Wow, what a beautiful town. Is that girl about to jump off the cliff? The water will rise and eventually drown everyone here, leaving our Hydro Archon to sit weeping on her throne for all eternity. Hi, twin sister! <laughs> oh, sorry, did I interrupt you talking about the prophecy where everyone in Fontaine is born within sin and one day we will all dissolve in the waters? I feel like that's <laughs> something I should know, but I never actually thought about it. Are they twins? I always assumed Lenny was like older and Lynette was like a year younger or whatever because that cutscene when they were younger and learning like magic tricks from that one dude Linny was I like almost half a head taller than her I, I just assumed that I don't know maybe I'm tripping <laughs> anyway I just assumed because there's you know them and Fermine that Linny was the oldest and then uh Fermine was just gonna be the youngest you know I don't know. That's a classic. Please Come tell me if they're show. twins or the not. Now I'm actually Linnea curious. Decide to take us to the I have them both. The I could just there, read their voice lines, but that seems like a lot of work. On herself. Farina. Welcome, travelers, to my city of Fontaine. Everyone, give them a warm welcome. They're fierce and noble warriors who have done much good for the land and its Paimon's people. Paimon's not a balloon. Hey, Go to jail. It's really nothing. We just tamed a giant dragon. Actually, I hereby declare the traveler under arrest for having a flying object, which is illegal. What? She's not even... Paimon doesn't count because she's a... A, a balloon. Yeah, Paimon's my balloon. <laughs> And she oh, bought it. That's funny. Case dismissed. Later. So. You gotta love Farina. Yippee! I know people are like half and half on Farina, but well, especially but after her Archon quest, you got to love her. Swaps boxes with a random audience member. A giant water tank falls onto the box, obliterating it. Oh my god, we killed my assistant Cowell? Why is he here and not the audience member? Speaking of which, where is she? A murder mystery plus disappearance case was now in place, with everyone looking at Linny as the prime suspect. Dude, Why was Lynette? 
a man she died. knew everyone starts trying to be a hero in China. Uh, only like half the people actually turned to look at him and Lynette was one of them the most looney tune ways possible but I can't really be bothered at this point and go outside to jump into the ocean using my new diving skills I was able to explore the whole world the water had to offer I was actually shocked when I first saw it because of how gorgeous it was I don't know why the people of yeah the underwater level it's awesome down here seriously the underwater level in Genshin was one of the like most well put together water levels of any game I've played. Like usually when you hear water level you think, oh god no, not again. But it's actually just really relaxing and calming in Genshin. I just literally, one of the first things I did in Fontaine was spend like a good 3-4 hours just swimming around. It was, it was relaxing, I didn't even feel like I was playing the same game. So great. It's because they die. After just swimming around and finding little secrets and treasures, I decided it was time to start fighting the fish. Yep, it was time to square I wonder what her experience with actually pulling long. was. Like, Eventually, if she actually did play through me out of the, water and dragged me back the, the entire game to get to Fontaine, or maybe she just skipped even a couple no regions, I'm not really sure. Literally saw him she probably gained some primos. Uh, Linny couldn't have killed Cowl because... Cowl killed Cowl! Dude, she's right! Yeah. What? Everyone's <laughs> freaking out at this point because somehow Cowl actually was the murderer and had a secret plan to dissolve people in water. I don't know, it was a lot of adults talking and big words. I was just thinking about punching fish the whole time. Next thing I know, people are punching shaking fish my was hand fun. and congratulating but don't punch me the seals, they just, they just Even sit Farina there. Is like, and they're, they're very doing. nice yeah, and they don't attack you. you so don't punch the seals, that's not nice. In jail for your own entertainment. You're also a funny one. I hope your people don't drown. With that, the trial is adjourned and I'm released from my forced upon lawyer duties, left to finally explore the world to my heart's content. There's so many more quests and stories to uncover in the game, also a lot of lore, so if you're a big theory head, proceed I am, your own that's risk. why I love Genshin. I enjoyed the time I spent playing Genshin Impact and was surprised at how beautiful the visuals and music are. It's I know! It's just a well-developed game that's pretty to look at. I got immersed in the world and spent hours exploring to find little secrets and- It got me in to Honkai Impact 3rd again because I have played it beforehand but like I I, had a great time learning I stopped about playing Honkai Impact 3rd around like chapter 5 or 6 or something and then I started playing Genshin and I was like oh my god the story is getting so good and I went back and started playing Honkai Impact 3rd I was like oh my god this game's good too and oh oh my gosh like, seriously, Hoyoverse games, they suck you in. If if you actually give them a chance and play them, because, you know, the first chapters are always, like, very introductory. But if you wait for the story to get good, it gets good, and it stays pretty good. About the universe. It's a great time learning about the universe. All right, there was a, another cut in there because there was another ad. playing the open-world action RPG game that is Genshin Impact yourself, then, ladies and gentlemen, if you would please look under your seats, you'll find... Oh, nope, sorry, actually, sorry, not your seat. I, I meant to say the description of this video. Oh, the first Windbloom Festival. You can click the link to download it for free. Yep, I said it already, but I'm saying it again. Genshin Impact is free to download. You can have zero money in your bank account yep. and still get to play it. And as, as long as you have at least a PC, mobile device, PS4, and then, or a PS5. Then you see the new character, battle, and you, you get fear like of missing pyro, out, dendro, and then you pull pyro, for that character, hydro, and, emo, and ultro, then it's not geo, so free anymore. And when fun, strategically, you can deal devastating elemental damage to your opponent. By the way, if you think you've spoiled the game's story for yourself by watching this video, you've never been no. more wrong in your life. There's so many more towns, quests, so You talked about the prologue in the worry, first, me, like, two hours of Fontaine. <laughs> As someone that wants to 100% the games I play as much as possible, I feared for my mind, body, and soul when I realized how much content there was waiting for me. Genshin Impact actually just released a new 4.2 update that includes new characters and even an entirely new storyline for Fontaine. There's a bunch yeah. of new events that let you play different kinds of minigames to win rewards. You got to meet her a little bit in the video already, but Farina is a huge new character in this update as you continue the next part of the Archon stories. Fontaine she is really fun to play too. She like completely changes how you build your characters and it, it's great. Materials. And local oh, it's so great. It's an ever-changing and growing game. I, I'm putting her on my new Valette team, but and right now she's on my Ayaka, Shenha, and Kokomi team. It's just pure freeze because new Valette's not 100% built yet. 
it's so freaking overpowered. <laughs> Everything dies so fast and they don't get a chance to attack you because they're frozen. It's my very safe, destructive team and I, I just love it. Especially when I'm not doing events or anything on stream, if I'm just playing. If I just want to take it really easy and not let the enemies attack me and do a shit ton of damage, that's the team I use. <laughs> Ollie, why not give it a try? I mean, the link's right there. I Plus she can walk on water. She's it. practically Jesus. Huge, huge thanks to the team for all their work on this video. That was such a good video, Jaden. They're incredible. I talked oh, over most of it, but I did actually really enjoy it. It was very good. They worked on, so make sure to perceive them. All their links are in the description as well. I wouldn't be able to be doing the things if, I'm doing without. Do them. you guys know They're if Jaden so streamed it? Because I know she does stream. Um, maybe she talked about it. I was talking. Let's. Let's go back a little bit and see if she talked about streaming it. Never changing. Because if so, I might go watch her stream. Has a lot of passion put into it, and if any of this sounds up your alley, why not give it a try? I mean, the link's right there. Might as, might as well just click it. Huge, huge thanks to the team for all their work on this video. They're beasts. They're machines. They're incredible. A while ago, we brought on a bunch of new people, and this is the first video I'm posting that they've worked on. So make sure to perceive them. All their links are in the description as well. First time I wouldn't playing be able Dungeons to be and Dragons. If you guys like this one, I don't think I've seen this one so either. Awesome. Thanks for so watching if you guys want to see me react to Jaden again, then I, like I said, I haven't seen that one. I didn't even realize she posted that one. Uh, then I, uh, I might watch that one for you guys too main channel Let me sponsored know. video. It's not going to become a common thing, but it was cool to give it a try. All right. See you later. All right. I guess that's it, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. This is my first official uh, reaction video back with my camera. So I can actually start using my VTuber again instead of just speaking into a mic with like no movement or anything. <laughs> so anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, it's been Rain, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.